So, I had breakfast, lunch, I brushed my teeth, um, but I need stuff um, like cotton buds to clean my ears, get the wax, you know, um, so I can hear properly, um, some pans and pots because, you know, I don't have any at the moment because, you know, I'm not prep properly um, because I, my dad was, he's a bit eager to rush. So so we had to go early rather than the uh, booked appointment and this is not appropriate wearing so um, yeah I will, shall see you when I get a change and also I shall see you in the store as well so yeah so yeah I am ready and I am ready yup yup is that I've got trousers on so I shall see you in the store. I have a will code savers or something. So yeah. In a bit. So expensive. Might go to B and M. BNM, BNM. Need a tray actually for pie and stuff. Yeah. Look, look how cheap that is. Two pound ninety nine for spatula and a pan. And look at this. Three pound ninety nine for tray only, compared to Wilco's. Four pound plus. Let's go. Yo. So I am back. I bought. The pan. My car drops up. I bought the pan with the spatula. Only two pound ninety nine. What a good deal. I bought gloves. You know, to wash up the bowl. You know, so I don't have to get my hand wet, and it gets dry easily. You know that moisture. Disgusting. Ninety nine b. Uh, this I can uh, put some, I don't know, chicken, um, if I want to make some cookies, which I doubt I'm going to make cookies. Um, but yeah, pie, because i got pie in the fridge already, so I can use this, put a pie on top, put it in the oven, heat around 5 to 10 minutes, and then good to go. How about the sieve? Not for flowers, um, it's an Asian thing. So, um, when you finish with your food or any leftovers, you put it in here, you, you, you put the leftovers in here and you use that so it doesn't go down into the drain of the sink. You know, life hacks apparently. So yeah. And why dropped? Cotton buds because you know I've got to clean those ears, um, so it doesn't get blocked with bloody ear wax, and so you can hear properly. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have a break and I will get on with the story that happened yesterday. Jesus Christ! Ugh. So yesterday's incident that happened, um, basically. Well, this is the first time that I've seen, um, like you see it in news, TVs, but like you wouldn't have thought that a game of football would lead to this, like, like I didn't record, like I was going to record, but there was too many people, it was so crowded, and also YouTube probably won't let me uh, put a clip on because, you know, against uh, YouTube guidelines, so yeah it involved uh sheffield united and if you didn't know sheffield united has been put into the premier league they have been promoted to the top league of english football and yeah from what i can see seeing this season um with sheffield united not wednesday um they are doing pretty well. They drew against Southampton, or even beat Southampton, I think. Um, 
they've they managed to bring back a 2-0 loss to a 2-2 draw against Chelsea. Chelsea of of all teams like but <clears throat> uh the game that happened yesterday, I can't remember, I didn't pay attention. Um but yeah, it's something to do with football and an old man and a teenager or kid. Like not kid kid but like um thirteen to like eighteen a teen to young adult um and the kid uh, threw a glass bottle or multiple glass bottles because you know you drink at a football match as you do like I drink at like you drink at a pub but football match may be dangerous because you can chuck bottles onto the field but yeah but I don't even drink much so yeah <clears throat> So yeah, lots of balls being smashed, and on this side, I think, um, of the old man's um, face, it's just blood, literally just blood where uh, the bottle was being thrown or smashed onto, and, and then Primark security came out and then had to, you know, hold each uh, two people so that they can not fight anymore to stop them from progressing even more and then the old guy is like gone then let's fight you know he, he's a bit tapped he's a special person like why why are you trying to fight uh, a kid a teen you get arrested just 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 leave it man like just just leave it Call the police and yeah, let them sort it out. But yeah, and what's the uh, bad thing as well is the old guy was bold. So you know, there was more skin showing because he's bold. So there's more of a. Um, how do you say this? So it's more open for him to get cut easily compared to if you have hair you just need to have stitches of in your hair or whatever I don't know never been uh, like that in that situation so I don't know but yeah literally from like from here so as you can see like the hairline from like here downwards like there blood like literally um, like where you can see the bloody um, glass crack Boom! Right, right on that face, by the neck slash ear. Um, and yeah, after that, the ambulance came. People gathered around, going, "What's happening here?" This and that. But yeah, that's the whole story of what happened yesterday. Um, damn, Jesus! I I was going into town to have a look at some stuff, <clears throat> and this happens like. Jesus. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video of the story, then smash the like button. Hopefully, football is going to be chill. Probably not. Um, and yeah, I think, yeah, the government, FA, whatever, police, council, I don't know. Focus more on you. On bloody... Stop about all the houses like the amount of houses crap yeah i'm just not gonna call it house i'm just gonna call it crap okay to be sorted okay stop stop thinking about houses and start thinking about your country properly like jesus christ the amount of um roadworks this and that jesus christ like how long does it bloody take like you got um that uh there's that freaking channel that makes some weird building they build more quicker than bloody our people and they use like bamboo they use soil as um cement to to
to uh, put all the bamboo together to create a wall and th this and that. So they actually build a swimming pool and um, a, a house. But over here, we we don't do crap all because we're all thinking about building houses, which takes, I don't even know how long it, it takes. Like, Jesus Christ, my ass. Like, Jesus. The amount of time it takes to just build a bloody crap. Like, it's just, like, me going up to Sheffield right now, yeah? My eyes just, my eyes just go from chinky to even more chinky. Like, like, Jesus. Is there even a word that surpassed chink? Like, or, or, I mean, not chink, squint. Like, is there even a, a more further word than a squint? Like, oh my god, how long does it take to build a path? Or, or, or build a little, I don't know, putting some bricks together? Jesus, it's been like... I, I don't even know. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, sm smash that like button. Don't forget to ring those bells. Subscribe if you're new. And yeah, I shall see you guys next time. Um, so yeah, peace out. Boom.